Light him up. Hello everyone, please are you welcome back to some more MechWarrior 5. So in the last episode we took on Comstar and a lot of other fun things have happened and yeah, can't wait to see what's gonna happen next. Um Definitely gonna have to do a little bit of fixing up with our mechs. Uh but first we gotta go up and talk to Rihanna and see what's gonna happen next. So let's just head up there, and when we do, I'm just going to meet myself real quick, and we'll begin. Hey, Commander. I've learned that Spears' people were able to recover some additional data from the Comstall Research Facility. I'll let Spears explain the details himself. Okay. Go ahead, Sebastian. Commander, nice work saving that main research building. It's been invaluable in our efforts to better understand some of Comstar's actions. I'm sure Rihanna has filled you in on what we initially discovered. Yeah, Comstar was using radio telescopes to help map the lost section of the star map, then using that data to aid in their search for more lost Star League facilities. Broadly speaking, that's it. Digging a little deeper into the remaining data, my people were able to find something quite curious. We found an additional map overlay Comstar were using in conjunction with the ancient star map. It shows that they've been tracking the movement of people and ships through this section of space. More specifically, people and ships headed into the inner sphere from somewhere out there in uncharted space. What ships? What people? What does this have to do with my father and the coordinates he had in his possession? I wish I had an answer for you, Commander. The truth is, it's a deepening mystery, but one I intend to solve with your help. What I'm positive of is that Comstar is on the verge of discovering something major. Something they're worried we might find first. That star map is the equivalent of a treasure map. Except it's missing one crucial piece, and I think we have that missing piece. Not all of it, but the part that matters the most. The X that marks the spot. You mean one of the coordinates we have in our possession? Precisely. But we still haven't decrypted the second set of coordinates, never mind the third. Not yet. But my people are working with Rihanna. It's only a matter of time. Except that Comstar isn't waiting around for us. No, they're not. Which is why I think we should give them a swift kick in the shins. Slow them down a bit. And buy me some time to get the second set of coordinates unlocked. Spears has identified a Comstar communications hub that we can attack and disable. Doing that should hamper their ability to communicate in this region of the periphery. It'll not only slow down their search, but force them to divert resources to rebuild and protect against future attacks. I like the sound of that. By the time you get us where we need to go, I should have the mission briefing ready. All right then, let's do this. Good luck, Commander. All right, that sounds a lot like the clan, uh, the clanners coming in from outside the galaxy. Oh, this is gonna be fun. All right, blackout. Uh, we get medium pulse laser, just one. Uh, no, that's actually pretty nice. Um, hmm. I'll probably put that bad boy right on my on one of my atlases. Okay, so we're gonna accept that. Um, yeah, you got messed up, my friend. Eee, really badly. Um, let's take a... Actually, we can't. Okay, uh, let's head to the nearest... Yeah, because there's nothing out here. We're not going there quite yet. We're going to go back here and get everything patched up because we are on... We are off the map. We aren't anywhere near anything. <laughs> um... We just need to fix everything up, get everything ready. Uh, because it does kind of feel like we're getting down towards the end of this campaign. And we got to make sure we're on our A game, you know what I mean? Um, let's take a look at the mech market. A dragon. Dragons are always fun, but no, that's actually not what we need. Let's go to our... He actually did pretty well. What did I? It's been a couple of days since I last recorded. What is it? Okay, so pulse, small pulse lasers, 
for close encounters this okay yeah and then i would also have the other missile slots okay so you're good to go right yeah so you really did not get a lot of damage to you the atlas what do you have on you my friend um actually you're looking pretty damn good only thing I would ever want to probably put on there is a burst fire AC-20, but that's actually quite good. Yeah, I think you're good to go, my friend. Um, chicken here. Practically everything's good to go. The Atlas is just gonna keep kicking. Takes a licking, keeps on ticking type of situation. Um... Oh, that's right, you have the shotgun. Um, I'm actually going to give you something else. But first, let's repair all we can. Let's go in here. Oh, we don't have a... It's 15 damage. That is 19. We're going to put that in there uh, I don't know if we can get away with that uh, five tons seven tons I would love to be able to okay, you know what let's try something here and let's also we can keep the shotgun up. Um, yeah. Looks like a weapon that fires a cluster of rounds at long range. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave that in there. Um, got the SRMs. Put that there. Put that there. Where can we... we have uh let's go to the market no no doubles um what if i move this down to a 10 that's still 12 damage it's still not that bad and give the best which is a 15 it's still pretty good Can we squeeze out just a little more? No, we cannot, can we? Oi. <clears throat> that's a that's a hard decision there. Um Whoa, really? Wait. Put that there. No. Yeah, no. Sorry. Oh, I want to be able to put just a little bit more in here, you know? It just sucks. Because no matter what I do, something's going over. Uh, Maybe... Let's put that back there. How much do you weigh? 11 tons. Oh, that's 12 tons. Wait, how in the hell is that one... Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I guess it's going to be have to be what it is, right? And we can't put anything else on it. Wait. I think I found it. Uh, 
That looks a little better. Okay, let's do that. That, ooh. Let's look at what we have there, buddy. Okay, that looks good to me. All right, that atlas is now gonna be rocking. Um, I don't think we'll be bringing you. But let's just get you repaired since we're here. Jeez. Um, yeah, if I remember correctly, you're just a missile boat. You just unleash hell. Which is a good thing. Helps out a lot. Let's repair all these. Now that sucks. Just put that in there. Okay. Definitely still could use the missile boats, but I think this time I'm going to be rolling in my atlases. Um, and probably going to be in this guy. Yeah, probably going to be in this guy. Uh, and let these guys just be in the back firing. Weapon grouping. I know that looks weird. I'm just doing it quickly. There we go. So. So the fire, 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 fire. Actually, I want to fight all those at once. Yeah, that's how I want to run it for the for the AI. They'll fire these, fire those so they don't overheat and then they can fire those. All right. That sounds good to me. All right. Now. Let's take a look at our, the pilots here. Damn. Dragon reporting. I know your story, and I'm ready to be of assistance, Commander. Yes, please. Hire. Exploration of fortune has brought us to meet. Glad Dragon to be reporting. on board, sir. Okay. I just want to buy that person. All right. Now let's head on back to the objective which is way out there. All right, hopefully you guys are enjoying the series so far in this episode. I know it's been going just a little bit long, uh, prepping, getting everything done. It just, you gotta be kind of careful with these missions. It could probably make or break the game. <laughs> or I should say this playthrough. All right, here we go. Level home, oh God. I'm going to start our communication hub. Oh boy. Do I want to go all in? What would I get if I went all in with money? Sweet googly moogly. I mean, yeah, that is... Ooh. I like that, but I also really like that. Because that is another huge mech. We're going for it. Anybody see an atlas, you take its legs out. All right, who's really good at missiles? You. You stay there. Uh, you're going to have to move out of that spot. I'm going to put you there. Uh, let's see. What do you have? Missile, critic. Hey, it's a good thing you don't have... Well, you do have missiles. Um, who could take your place? Honestly, I don't think it's going to matter. All right. Wait. Sure. Let's do it. All right. We'll get it on. A little nervous, but I think we got this.
Sensors online. Weapons online. Oh All boy. Systems phenomenal. The target is Comstar's communications hub. It needs to be reduced to rubble in order to limit their operating proficiency in the region. Could you park any closer to the damn right, thing? Commander. Move, guys, move. Uh oh. We have a problem here. I messed up with the missiles. I'll have to fix that between now and the next mission. Yeah, we don't have any of those. I screwed that up. My bad, guys. Um, so, yeah, we just have that. We just. Crap, we don't have a lot of weapons now, do we? No, we do not. All right. We got this. Maybe. Left or right? I think we want to go to the right. Then again, why am I worried about missiles? We literally have... A lot of people backing us. What comes to missiles? Oh, I'm gonna have so much fun with that. Just want to test out around. All right, let's get in. Let me do this. Target on scope. Where? Tank spotted. Again? Where? Whoa! That's where. Um, I'm glad I know you guys are firing at. I have no idea. things on the keyboard. Ah, no. Light him up. We are surrounded by enemies.
this shack then, I won't lie. <laughs> I love it a lot. get rid of most of these vehicles. Oh my god. She's in that stalker, so that stalker apparently is not as good. Uh, we might want to think about taking something else like the king crab. Uh, just a little more armor. Stalker's nice, but having two of them, I think, is probably too much. The other one was awesome because it was really dishing out the pain. But uh, we're about to find out. All right, come on. We'll see what kind of goodies we can get today. Yeah, we're gonna sell this cicada. Medium lasers, medium lasers. Just getting lots and lots of loot. Gonna get a couple of those. Really sucks. I mean, have anything else? Okay, so you lost an arm. Really? It was this one? Okay. So this is what lost a component. Oh man. Okay, let's go speak to Rhiannon. And then we're going to go and get ourselves repaired again. Oh, wow. Okay, this has got to be important. Mute. Hi, Commando. This encryption program is fascinating. It's also frustrating as hell. Each set of coordinates your father had was designed to be progressively more difficult to unlock, though I'm not certain why. That said, I've been tackling all three of them in parallel. And with Spears' help, Progress has accelerated nicely. Truth is, 
If it weren't for the advanced computing resources made available by IE, I'd never have unlocked them. That's my long-winded way of telling you that I've managed to crack the second set of coordinates. We finally unlocked another potential clue to your father's past. That's great. I hope these coordinates reveal more than the last set did. Have faith, Commander. Get us to that system and let's see what we find. You never know. We might just get lucky. Copy that. Inform Spears that we're on the move. I don't want to wait around here a second longer than we have to. Understood. All right, let's get it on. Uh, we're going to just jump quickly over where is... Oh, I got to check. Um, transmission, click. That number seems familiar. Why is that number familiar? Uh, we're going way off the beaten path. But we got to repair first. At least it's not going to be a long-winded grabbing, 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 grabbing. It's just going to grab and go, grab and go. The only thing I'm going to switch... Whoa. Rare Highlander. Nope. The only thing I'm going to change is going to be on... Oh, I guess not. We got an extra one of those. There we go. Cue it up. I was... In a really okay shape. Um, I think we're going to keep this one around. That one we're going to replace with probably the king crab. I think. Just doing that temporary. There's a reason why we're going to go up to work orders, cancel the stalker. Oh crap, on oh, mine as well. Might as well just cancel them all. Yeah, that's mine. Repair. Let's go to loadout. Click that out. Thank you, remembering Sarge. Ha ha. I remember things. That sounds good to me. Uh, the stalker, we're going to upgrade a few of your things. Uh, do that. And then another. Wait. No. Oops. One of those is a 15, wasn't it? No, it was just a stream. Okay, got it. Um, okay. We're good to go. Uh, we're going to sell off the cicada. So to this is the beast. This is the beast. Yeah, no. Yeah, you're awesome. That just missiles. Uh, we're going to go over to sell. Sell off the cicada. Don't want it. Honestly, probably should sell, sell off one of the stalkers. sell it just in case. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. I have no idea what we're in for, but it's gonna be fun! Or very, very painful. I think I might bring my clan mech out with me this time. Uh... Okay, we're at the coordinates, right? A 
Okay, yeah. More talking. All right, here we go. Commander, I've completed my initial scans. This planet appears to be the location of a lost Star League spaceport. Unfortunately, it also appears that, once again, Comstar have gotten here before us. Why were these coordinates so important to Yamada if Comstar already had them? Why were they worth killing for? I don't know. The more pertinent question is, how does this location tie into your father's past? Let's focus on that for now. Is the briefing ready? It's waiting for your sign-off. Good. It's time we get some real answers. Okay. Well, let's do it then. Shall we? View transmission. Um, we're just going. Um, uh, I'll be circling above one. There it comes. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Let's go. Contact. Contact. Feel like I got gyps on the last time, but you know what? We're still going for it. Because <laughs> you never know. And um, I'm going to stick with my mech. I'm going to stick with that one. She's still going with that one as well. Um... Is she good with missiles? Yes. Is there anybody better with missiles? Not really. Okay, so we're going to give her a, pr a little special prize. We're going to give her that. I just think this will be a lot better multi-role. While we're up in the front, these two in the back. He yeah. Okay, let's do it. Whew. A little nervous. Light them up. Feels like it's gonna be a really bright map. Weapons online. Nope, this is a normal map. Okay, here we go. Punch it. The spaceport is just up ahead, Commander. We already know Comstar is here, but we don't know how many forces they have on site or how prepared they are for a fight. If we're lucky, maybe we can catch them off guard. That'd be nice. Yeah, for once. Kidding me? I said it to repair this thing. Whatever. I should still be okay, right? I am in an atlas. I feel like I just went in a fight with one arm tied behind my back. That's what it feels like. Yeah, I don't like this. It's way too quiet. Enemy patrol commander. Oh, Looks like the element of surprise is out the window. You think? Tango spotted. Target. We've got an incoming enemy mech. Enemy vehicles inbound. Engaging commander's target. from
take a little bit at a time. We'll take a little bit at a time. We got this. We got this. We don't like no LRMs. No. guys get them I feel bad for these guys are in the tanks not much longer pushing guys okay. why do I have to pick a slow a slow mech on a big map this really sucks They have a beautiful view. Another urban section up ahead, Commander. Looks like Comstar hasn't done much to shore up their perimeter defenses yet. But keep That's an eye good. out for enemy mechs. They must have a few down here for defense. You had to jinx it. You just had to jinx it. Get him. Oh, I turned the corner at the wrong time.
got your arm. Go right through it, right through the dude. Come here. Fun. I just really wish I didn't. Uh, I wish I would have actually had this to be repaired. Comstar has already started excavation operations, searching for lost tech. Luckily for us, doesn't appear they've been here for too long, or made much progress thus far. That's good. More for us. Oh, we got incoming. Vehicle spotted. Crush their crews under your feet. You have issues, lady. Two AC twenties. That is a scary looking thing. He's down, and that looks like a ship. That's definitely a ship parked. All right. Kill confirmed. Destroyed. I have some very demented pilots. They're gonna fit right in. can blow up over here. Man, this place got well, it did get abandoned. But man, over the centuries it just fell to the wayside. I want it. I want it. I want it. I want it. This was far more than a simple refueling station. But when Star League was still in charge of the Atmosphere, this must have been a key transport hub.
But I want that shuttle. Three whole lances? Man, that'd be awesome. It really would be. So I'm stuck with just one. Mech Warrior 6. Let us have multiple lances, please. That'd be awesome. Not being held up by much. Target sent to hell. Whoa. Watch your fire. Watch your fire. You. We're coming to you, Commander. I am all types of messed up. Oh, I recognize these things. What's all this damn walking? What is this, Mech Walking Simulator 2022? She. Um. Kind of like this way. We gotta be almost done with this. Come on. These missions are fun, don't get me wrong, but sometimes if you don't have a fast mech. I, I mean, I actually, on one of my uh, off plays, I have a mech that goes like 32, if not a little slower, like maybe 28. It is slow. It's one of the Annihilators, and it has like four giant uh, AC5 burst, and... That's pretty much it. I just loaded up with ammunition and so much armor. I sit in the back, just da 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 da. But the point is, that sucker is slow. I would never take it on this mission. It would be back halfway by now, still. Please tell me this is the spaceport. Enemy dropship inbound, oh, Commander. Of course it is. Where, 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 where? I want to make sure I have this wall in between me and them when they drop. Where's this drop ship? Quote unquote drop ship. Oh, I'm going to the high ground. There they are. Watch your flanks. Roger that.
Damn it. Oh, I'm getting beat up. Pretty hard. Got that battle master. Don't sound too calm about it. It's not a good thing. Gotcha. Go down. Oh boy. Commander, we're picking up a very faint radio signal emanating not far from your current position. I think it's a homing beacon of some kind. That's not good. Farhad says it's pinging the victor. My father's victor? That's right. What? Farhad was lucky to even notice it on his diagnostic display. Okay. Mark the location. I suggest you investigate. No kidding. All right, we're on our way. Hopefully, it's not too far. And hopefully, we don't encounter a lot of other things because that hurt. I want that battle master. That battle master will really help out our lands. Hell, I would, I will take another atlas at this point. I want a full. Steiner Scout Lance. On quick approach. Be alert. Man. You don't know when to leave well in a balloon, do you, Commander? You caused me enough trouble for a lifetime. Today, that end, some star will not be stopped. What? You ordered the death of my father. You're not leaving this place alive, Yamada. We'll see about that. I really wish I had my freaking... for his legs. I want that mech. down so it means I gotta be in the wrong back. Okay, what are my weapon groupings? Uh, okay, AC-20 is... Okay, his leg is 
gun. The legs are about to be gone. I want that. I want that. That is mine. That is my mech. Farhad says that Victor has been trying to return the signal it received, but the return signal was partially corrupted. What? Farhad managed to restore it. I've transmitted the repaired signal to your mech. Try activating it yourself, and let's see what happens. Okay, I like where this is going. Please tell me I think I what it is. Please tell me I think it what it is. Holy shit. I've never seen a mech like that before. And in pristine condition. Alright, I'm on my way down with Farhad and the salvage team. The hell is that? Roger that. Don't care. I like it. Holy crap. That's a cool looking mech, whatever it is. Damn, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Taking on all that annihilator at the end. Woof. It doesn't get any harder than that. I was practically on one leg, just hopping with one gun. That sucks. But uh, hopefully, we can get our hands on that annihilator. Oh, dear God, let me have that annihilator. Annihilators are awesome, they're slow. But man, can they dish out so much firepower. Ooh, legendary. Nice. All right, you guys might have noticed a little bit of a cut right there. Um, if you didn't, oh, uh, don't worry about it. But right after we finished the mission, the game crashed. I had to replay the mission. Uh, it was practically the same outcome, only I only lost one mech instead of two. Um, so we get... The Night Star. Damn. I'm going to have to play with that thing a little bit. Okay. Uh, let's see. Mother. Oh, that kind of makes me mad. Some goss ammo. I have a feeling we're going to be using that. Uh, let's pick up the this guy right here for just some extra cash. Sell him off. No! Such a torso destroyed. We lost one of our pilots we've had for a long time. Oh, man. All right, well, you guys can read this. Pause it and read it. All right. Oh, man, that sucks. That really does. All right, well, we're going to leave talking to her for the next episode. It has gone on long enough. Um, we are probably well over the hour mark. So that is going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. And if you guys have any comments, suggestions, or feedback about this episode, let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you guys are not already, check out my Discord. Links for that will be in the description down below. And last but not least, I would like to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile to help support the channel. It really means a lot to me. Every dollar does help. So until next time, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys. Remember, have an awesome day.